Okay, so where did we stop? Okay, let's go next year. Just give me a second. Here, what bone? Um, radius. Yes. Okay, that's the other move here. Okay. Um, nasty again. What bone and what uh what part? Um, like the humerus and uh, lateral epicondyle. Good. Good. See, you get it now. Perfect. All right, uh, Marina. What what part? What is this? Uh, she maybe you have uh, trouble with your voice. We don't hear you. Maybe you're muted. Yeah, she's muted. No, I Yes, yes. Go ahead. Uh, it is anterior nasal spine. Okay, there we go. Who was here, brother? Uh, metatarsal, the last metatarsal. So, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I think it's look we are looking at the joints here. So uh the meta metatarsal phalangeal joint. So I think we're looking at not the joints, but uh because this is not the joint. It's the bone. Yes. Okay, so metatar metatarsal. Okay, there we go. Uh Nastia, this part? Um uh symphy wait um physical um surface of pubic exactly uh, oh really yes yes you're right symphysial surface exactly uh marina well it's um sacrum to tuberosity it goes well it's probably can be sacro Let's try. You're right. Okay. Sacrotuberous. Yes, sacrotuberous ligament. Um, what does the sacrotuberous ligament function? What What is it? Okay, I don't know how to ask this, but the sacrotuberous ligament is the ligament that creates the lesser sciatic foramen from the lesser sciatic notch. You got it? Okay. Yeah. Um, I was. Okay, if I was uh, a pin and an oral question for you. Come on. Can you go, okay, uh, so that's the popliteal surface. Yeah. All right. So what bone? Femur. femur. Can you the can you... the right femur? The wait, the right femur. You're right, brother. Amazing. Sorry. Uh, right, right. Yeah, it's the right femur. It's the right femur. Um, okay, so tell me, tell me, um, distally, distally, uh, I need the, the name of the joint, the type of the joint, what movements? So we, we have the knee joint. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, what, what was the second part? Uh, type of joint. Type of joints. Okay. So it's, uh. Type of joint. It's a sinoweal joint, hinge type sinoweal joint. Perfect. What movements? Movements. So uh, I'm not very sure about the movements. I need to study that. Okay. So from, from just things that make sense. So you can do when you do this with your leg, what is it? The flexion uh, extension. So you do extension and, uh, and flexion. That's it. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah. So hinge joint is flexion extension. That's it. Okay. Good. Okay. All right. Nastia. Yeah. What bone, Nastia? Hello, Nastia? Oh, excuse me. Uh, what? Femur? Yes. Fe no. Can you repeat? Um, I just do not see the end. Maybe, um, ah, like uh, fibia, Fib Fib fibula. fibula, exactly. Fibula, yeah. Okay, what is it in here? Yes, there we go. That's the that's the fibula. Okay, no, wait, 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 wait. A white fibula. I think it is, um, wait, I can see it. It's tibia. 
That's a oh, weird. Dear. That's actually a weird angle for me. One second. Can't even see. Ah. Mm. How can this be a tibia? And uh, you don't have a medial. Ah, there we go. That's the medial malleolus, but it's a different. And uh, you're right. So that's a tibia. Because this is the fibular notch. Exactly. TB. Okay. Good. Everybody good? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Let's go. Um, Marina? Yeah. Um, so it's uh, humerus and it's trochlea. Lateral trochlea or it's not? Try, try again. again. The red one. Uh, yeah. This one is like a reticular surface for its, for the elbow joint. And it, yes. this... Which bone? Articulated with what bone? With... Um, well, we have like this. It's the right one. Mm -hmm. So it's going to be an ulna. Try again. Is it radius? Yes, so why radius? Why right, radius? yeah. Ulna, it's close to uh, medial epicondyle. Exactly. And, and yeah, radius. One, you see you see this you see this part here? Always yeah. note this is the trochlea. Trochlea, and, this yes, one. The trochlea here that is shaped like, I don't know, uh, some sort of a dog, uh, dog bone here okay this one this is always the trochlea this is where the ulna comes so this one the ball capitulum articulates with the radius okay mm -hmm. capitulum of humans all right good yeah. yeah okay uh my brother uh tell me what is this joint uh that is the uh that is the hip joint yes can you tell me uh, oral question for you what is what is the what is the articular and it's good for everyone to actually practice oral as well. Um, what is uh, what is this uh, what okay hip joint? What's the what's the bones involved? Articular surfaces. The bones involved are the uh, pelvic bone and the uh, uh, femur, the head of femur. Okay, so the head of femur is one articular surface. What part of the pelvic uh, bone? Uh, the acetabulum. Exactly. Mm -hmm. What's what type of joint is this? The synovial joint. Which type of synovial? Uh, ball and socket. Exactly. What type of movements in ball and socket do you have? So flexion, extension, uh, and then we have rotation as well. Yes. You have medial and lateral rotation. Exactly. What else? What else? There's two more. Because it's bone socket. Uh, circumduction. Yeah. Yes. So that's for the. Is is that just for the hand or for? So bro, what we what we usually say is this: flexion, extension, uh, lateral medial rotation, abduction, adduction, full full movements. Okay. 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 There we go. <laughs> Hip joint, perfect. Uh, Nastia. Mm -hmm. Nastia, please mm. tell me what uh, what part of what 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 bones present? Three of them. Um, femur, uh, tibia, and fibula. Okay, so um, what part is labeled in red? In red, tell me. Um, I think it is um, lateral. Lateral condyle or or wait. Mm. I agree. Uh, I, I almost agree, but I don't know. I agree. You agree? Yes, I agree. But let's see. Okay. Uh huh. Ah, what the fuck? Wait. There we go. Femur lateral condyle. Perfect. Oh, uh, okay. Be confident. Do it. Yes, you're right. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um. All right. So, Marina, what? Uh, what? What's this? It is a posterior crucial ligament. Hmm. Amazing. Okay. <laughs> um. But, 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 wait, wait. So how is this shaped? Wait one second. I do this. I do this. Uh. No. 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 So that's. Uh huh. So. Here. Why? 
why do we see the the inferior end of the of the feminine? Yes, why? It is oh, flexed. Sorry, it's not. Oh, wait, is that so? That's the patellar. Yes, that's a medial condyle. It's not the patellar. Yes, exactly. It's flexed. Okay. Easy. Okay. Uh, posterior cruciate ligament. Okay. Another. Uh, please, again, I remind you when you're revising your knee joint. Please, I'm telling you when you get to the specifics of posterior anterior cruciate ligaments, I need you to understand and read about the attachments here and where it attaches then, and then attachments here, and where it goes to attach then. And then you can see it rotate around each other because he sometimes asks these questions. Okay. Um, Fawaz, brother, what, uh, what, what, what's this? <laughs> it's a good question. What's this, bro? What part of the body? Uh, I can't hear you. I think you're muted, brother. Sorry, uh, that is the talus. Okay, so this is the thing. Okay, first off, what part of the body? Everything, everything here you're seeing. What's this? Uh, this is the foot. Foot, okay. The foot so, bones. So what, what, uh, and Nasya, I think you, you're smiling now because I, because you asked me this question. Brother, what angle, what ah. angle, <laughs> yes. What angle are you looking at the foot from? Can you tell me? Are you looking? Yes. I don't want to give you hints. So I'm looking at the foot, but what side am I looking at the foot from? So is it like dorsal, ventral? Well, so, maybe use in superior, inferior. Is this the superior or the inferior feet? Superior. Superior. Can you, can you? Can sorry, you sorry, what? sorry. Uh -huh. Tell me. It's uh, it's actually inferior because I can see the heel of calcaneus. Exactly. And, bro, okay. Careful. Like, do uh, not, yes, do not jump in and tell me this is the superior view, bro. We always know that the talus is always on top of uh, calcanus in the superior view. We always know that. Why? Right, because, yeah. because the articulation of the ankle joint, when you study it, is the calcanus involved. Mm. It's not involved. What's involved is the talus. Talus articulates with both tibia and fibula. So now you're like, what the fuck? Why is talus? Why is calcanus on top of talus in this view? Now we know this is the inferior point of view, okay? Mm. So what's this part? Uh, that is the uh, calcaneal tuberosity. Yes, or calcanus, okay? Calcanus. There we go. So be careful, brother. Don't don't go, go in. And, this is an easy this is an easy point for you in the pins. So next time, I don't yeah. know what happens in the future and stuff like that. Boom, you go in, you write talus. Be careful what point are you looking at the, at the foot and then you answer, okay? Okay. Okay. Um, uh, but, 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 okay, wait, 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 come. Tell me, just before I move on, you have orals. So tell me, uh, talus, can you, can you, are you able to describe to me? And I think Nasi, you know this very well, but uh, Fawaz, you tell me, tell me how the talus articulates Tell me about the ankle joint. Articulation. I want articulation very specifically. If you know this man, I think I think uh, I'll be happy. Tell me. So there are three joints. The most important one is the ankle joint. Mm -hmm. That's between the talus. Okay, so that's between the bones of the leg. So tibia and fibula and the talus. Okay, good. You gave me the bones. Now tell me For furthermore. Then we have the subtalar joint between the uh, talus and calcaneus. Subtalar joint between? Talus and calcaneus. Okay, we don't give a fuck about uh, that one. I want only the like the articulation between tibia, fibula, talus. Can you describe it to me? How how would you tell this to Siriski? And this is very important for all of you. Hmm. Okay, what part of the of the talus articulates with tal? Uh, what part of the tibia articulates with talus, brother? Tell me. Uh, the the distal uh, the distal part. So yes. uh. Yes. Can you be more specific? So uh, the I think it's the condyles. The 
uh, it's not condyle. It's called something else, not condyle. That's it. Okay, good, good, good. It's okay, it's okay. Uh, now, concentrate with me very quickly. Please, 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 for this point. Because it, it's nice to always uh, jump on things that are actually very, very interesting. Um, 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 wait, let's go. Uh, ankle joint. I will share with you what I'm talking about. Ankle joint. Let me do this. Just give me a second. I'll get back to our progress, but it's good that we brought this up. If I share with you here, share. Do you see my view? Okay. Yeah, yeah. So now, let's see. Boom, here. Okay. This is the joint I was talking about, okay? Mm -hmm. Now, you have the talus, yes? Yeah. Okay, talus. Tibia, fibula. Yes? Yes. Okay. So now we're saying, um, I, Arsirisky asked me about, yo, please tell me about the articular surfaces of the ankle joint. Okay? I'm going to mm -hmm. say it quickly and maybe see how I describe it. And if you want to write it down, it will it will be okay for me to repeat it for you. If not, it's okay. Now, this is how I'm going to okay. tell you. Okay. So Risky asked me, uh, hey, Tim, please tell me the articular surfaces of the ankle joint. And I go and I say, okay, the talus has medial, medial articular surface, superior articular surface, lateral articular surface. Okay. Mm -hmm. Next, I'm going to say the tibia articulates with the talus on two regions. It's medial articular surface and it's superior articular surface. And then I have to be even more specific. And I'm going to be like, the tibia articulates, or let's say, let's say this way, the tibia uses its lateral articular surface of the medial malleolus to articulate mm. with the medial articular surface of the talus. What do you understand? I'm going to repeat again. The lateral articular surface of the medial malleolus articulates with the medial articular surface of the talus. So this has an articular surface. This has an articular surface. You get it? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Next, the superior articular surface of the talus articulates with the inferior articular surface of the tibia. Deal? Mm. Finally, okay, yeah. finally, I have the fibula and the talus. So the talus has a lateral articular surface. The lateral articular surface of the talus articulates with the medial articular surface of the lateral malleolus. Okay? Okay. This is how we talk about it. And, and we will right. probably get to that in the future, but it's nice to mention it. Okay. Let's go back. Ba ba ba. Okay. Here. Yes. No, not this stuff. Not this stuff. Okay. Uh, whose turn? Uh, Nastia. This is done. What bone, Nastia? Um. Uh, let me see it. Um. This is a fa um tibia. Yes. Exactly. Perfect. What uh, part? Um, wait, and uh, this is um lateral or wait, 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 fibular articular medial. Uh huh. So, Me the, the TV does not have a lateral myelose, but I don't know if this is labeling is for the malleolus, but you're right, but it has a more specific labeling malleolar groove. Okay, mm -hmm. there's a groove here, there's labeled so malleolar groove. Generally, this is the uh, uh, medial malleolus. So I'm proud of you. You got it. It's not, the tibia does not have a lateral malleolus. Okay, go. Uh, Marina, uh, what bone? Uh, uh, it's ulna. Ulna, exactly. And and I, I love how you now recognize it. Okay. 
ventral ventral point so we're looking at it from like like from the anterior view ventral point okay mm -hmm. uh that's the dorsal point you're looking at it from the posterior view uh uh what is it uh what is it for what what uh, what process will what part of what part of what process uh, sorry well Jane, uh, uh, that is the uh that is Okay, this is the ulnar, so ulnar process. Sorry, a uh, cor cor coronoid process. Yes, coronoid process. Okay, uh, Nastia, um, what part? Nastia? What? What first? What bone? Uh, this is humerus. Humerus. What part? How are we looking at the humerus? At uh, the posterior view. Exactly. What? Uh, what's this part labeled? Um, I think this is um. Wait, um, tracheal fossa. Wait, um, tracheal, uh, tracheal condyle. So I think this is just the trochlea. I think. I don't know. What do you think? Um, but this is the pla wait. Oli, olecranon fossa. Um, yeah, maybe this is trochlear. This just trochlear. Yes. So trochlear human. Good. So oh, you, you said yeah. something about trochlear, fossa, trochlear, whatever, but you, you're right. This is trochlear, okay? Mm -hmm. Just uh, let's shape our answers, but amazing. All right, uh, Marina, what bone? Calcanus. Calcanus. But what, what part of the... How are we looking at the foot here? The lateral part. Exactly, there we go. Calcanus. All right, uh, for us, brother, what uh, what ligament, brother? Okay, so, okay, this is the sacrospinous ligament. Okay, uh, let's see, perfect. And um, 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 what what foramen is formed by this ligament? Greater sciatic foramen okay. from the greater sciatic notch. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Uh, Nastia, what what part? Mm, this is um a femur. Yes, exactly. And this is a lesser, and and this is a lesser um trochanter. Amazing. Uh, Marina, what? Ah, uh -huh, this is a good one. What uh, part here? What's this thing? This is posterior view of ankle joint, and I think yes. it is the anterior crucial ligament. Okay, let's see. Okay, but what joint again? Uh, knee joint. Did I say ankle or yes, something? Yes. Oh. Okay. So, anterior cruciate ligament. Okay? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, Marina. Oh, sorry. Uh, for what? For what? What's, what, what's this, bro? Um, okay. It's attached on the fibula. Mm -hmm. So... <laughs> Uh, is it the collateral ligament? No, it's not the collateral ligament. Mm. I really don't know. Okay, let's see. There, it's the accurate popliti. So you have Popliteal. yes. So you have uh, you have always. Um, you have oblique popliteal and arcuate popliteal. Okay, uh, oblique. I think this is the oblique. I, I, I'm not sure. <laughs> right, and then you have the arcuate. It's just the ones they just dissected it. It's just a hard one, but yes, this is the arcuate. Um, okay, boom, Nastia. What view of the of the foot? Mm, this is um, superior uh, view. Yes, so now now when you are in a hurry, you can be safe. Now you know it's talus, okay? Yeah, and I think it, yeah, just talus. Yes, so that, there we go, easy. Okay, um, Marina, before I move on, what's this bone? Uh, navicular bone. Are we sure? Probably scuboid. This is... <laughs> <laughs> This is this is the cuboid. That's the navicular. You're right. Okay. Navicular. Yeah. Yes. Yes. You're right. Ah, there we go. Navicular. Okay. Easy. All right. Um, for was. 
Yeah. What's this? That is the quadrituberco. That is what? Quadrituberco or intertrochanteric line. That's what one of them. I think it's the intertrochanteric, like peri intertrochanteric, but let's see. Yes, intertrochanteric. So, okay. Mm, one thing to say about this part, why why is it important, guys, to learn fins? Why? Because look, this this region especially is one of the regions in the femur that is so that that gets exposed to so many injuries. Apart from the neck of the femur, this one exposed to so many injuries and so many surgeries uh, come come uh, to get performed on this region. Okay, so just a hint, just uh, info. Okay, um, 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 ah, that's one good. So what what is what is Anastia? Um, mm. What's what's this? Radial fossa. Exactly. Radial fossa. Exactly. Quickly, quickly, good radial fossa. Why capitulum radial fossa? This fossa houses the radial head when the when the when the arm is uh, flexed. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Ah, nice one. Mm. Oh, this is sick. Marina, uh, what's this? Uh, yeah, it's fibula. How? What? What happened to the fibula here? Hmm. Uh, it turned back. Yes. So they rotated it like this. Yeah. It's nice. It's nice. Look, now you have practice. Now you know the bones. Ba ba ba. Quickly. Now you know exactly. Mm -hmm. It shouldn't be like this. Okay. Mm -hmm. And that's the lateral view that we don't care. Fine. Uh, mm, this one. Ah, perfect. Uh, brother, what is this? Pelvic girdle. Sorry. Or pelvic bone. So which one? Oh, uh, the red part. That's red uh, red. ilium. Ilium bone. That's exactly. See, guys. You see these regions here. That separates the bones. When you study orals, you have to be able to describe how this is separated and where it's separated exactly and stuff. We'll go over it. So, okay. Ilium, good. Um, Nastia. Um, um, so, this is uh, femur and this is medial condyle. Good. See, good. You... A femur, you know, in your brain, this is the right femur. Boom, medial, medial condom. But, uh, but oh, it's this one. Tubercle. It's a ductal tubercle. I'm sorry. Oh wow. But 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 the whole thing is the medial condyle, like this is here. But this is a ductal tubercle. Okay, a ductal. Oh, tubercle. I didn't. Yeah, I didn't notice. Tu yes. Tubercles here. Tubercles are sites of attachment of muscles. Okay. Mm -hmm. A ductal tubercle. But I like how you know how you know where the medial condyle is. Just remember that these 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 prominent things are the condyles. But if it's labeled somewhere else, it's not okay. Good mm -hmm. learning. Okay, um, Marina, please tell me what's this process? Coracoid process. Nice. And what uh, what uh, what bone? Scapula. Scapula. Okay. The second... Today we had acromioclavicular joint, and when I just saw this specimen, I was like, "What the fuck is that?" Yes, I know. <laughs> okay, yeah. um, which I don't know. Well, it's very hard for me to know. But what uh, what scapula is this? Which scapula? Mm. Right. Yeah, or... So it connected. Right. So acromion is always like outside. I say, I it's think always so. Facing, facing where? Acromion. Huh. Anterior or posterior? Acromion. Um. Mm -hmm. So this one. I can say like by this, uh, if I see that uh, um, posterior side, it is mentioned there. So posterior side is attached to the... Um, Ribs. Mm -hmm. Oh, really? It's it, the the. No coastal surface is over. No, not like this. Okay, okay. so yeah, acromion is outside. Yes, like, I think you can just feel it. Yes. Pull, pull. So it's gonna be. If I take this, it's gonna be left here. 
Hear the scapula. Hear the. I think it's left. Try again. Okay, I will turn to another side. So this one. Uh, coastal surface supposed to be here and focal process. Then right. Oh. Yes, it's right. The coastal surface, you can see, if I put this exactly like it is, I take it and put it on the right, it fits. Mm -hmm. Look, you have, you have the lateral border and the posterior mm -hmm. border. Okay. Lateral border, posterior border. So if I put it here, boom, it's, it fits because the glenoid cavity will be laterally. Easy. Okay, yeah. Coastal surface here, this is what touches the ribs, okay? Mm -hmm. Easy, good. Um, for what, brother? What bone? This is the radius. And I think I'm looking at the interosseous border, mm -hmm. the radius. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Perfect. Uh, yeah, Nasty, you asked me about this today. Uh, tell me, oh. what's what's this region? What's this? Um, so I see like um, atlas and axis yes. and uh, occipital base, yeah. Uh, I, think what is it? I think they're referring to a joint here. It's red. Mm, no, I, I say in general, but yes. um, mm, a plano axial joint. Yes, exactly. Ah, lateral. Um, okay. Okay. Um, 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 Marina, what bone? What? Which part? Which? Which one? Right or left? What's this region? Yeah, uh, firstly, I have a question. Yes. Uh, Interosseous uh, border, it's always like sharp, really sharp, yes. to make interosseous membrane. It's the thing that it forms? No, it's okay. So the interosseous membrane is basically ligaments. Yeah. Just a big sh ligament that, that this ligament, when it attaches, it attaches on the interosseous border. Mm -hmm. That's it. Okay. So the this one is femur. Mm -hmm. Uh, it is the. Mm, ah, this femur is a right one, right femur. Nice. And it is the medial. Uh, condyle. Okay, I agree with you. Femur. If we're right, there, like. Sometimes I, I, I'm I maybe, maybe maybe people like are wrong about this. I think it's condyles, yeah. Let's just be sure. Like when I was studying, I never I never I never knew I never knew that the femur had an epicondyle. I always knew that big bones had condyles. The small bones had epicondyles, but I don't know why I've seen this repeat now. Let's wait. Today no. I we had the uh humorous. And instead of uh, writing epicondyle, I said it's medial condyle, and I oh, didn't wow. get. Yes, see, so, yeah. the small bones are always epi. Big bones. Yeah, are epi. Femur, it's not, it's not like small. Okay, here. Let's see. I'm just trying to check for my info. Um, does femur have condyle or epicondyle? There. It says prominent lateral and medial condyles are found at the distal end of the femur. Projecting from each condyle is an epicondyle that act as an attachment site for collateral ligaments. So they're called condyles, but what projects from it is an epicondyle. Okay, now I understand. See here, if we rotate it, we can see big, like uh, two structures that, that are shaped like two balls, right? These balls on the back are the condyles. And what protrudes from them is an epicondyle. Okay? You so don't it can that... be on the lateral side even. Yes, exactly. So... Exactly. Okay. okay. So My posterior just... view, it, it will have only condyles. Yes, you can see medial epicondyle, lateral epicondyle, but on the back, you can see which ones are condyles. But when you look at the humerus, it's always epicondyle, medial, lateral epicondyle, okay? Easy? Okay. Uh, for what's brother, this red one? Uh, why is it not? I don't know. We can't see it. Let's just see what they're referring to. Okay, let's try that. Easy. Okay, bro. Tell me, what's this? 
What's this joint? Uh, that is the proximal tibiofibular joint. Yes. Tibiofibular. Um, Nastia, what is this? Mm, I think. What bone? Mm, this is humerus. What? Posterior view. Nice. And, um, but I'm not sure. Isn't it a tuberosity? I uh, don't think so. I think it's either tuberosity or tubercle, but let's see. Yes, so the greater tubercle. Good. Uh -huh, greater tubercle. Okay. Tubercle. Tubercle. Greater uh, tubercle. Okay. Where is the where is lesser one? I think I think it's on wait, so mm, mm, I think this one here is the lesser. But let's check. Oh really? Yes, let's check. Lesser and greater tubercle. Um, by the way, I, I'm not sure, maybe only me, but I do not see your your screen uh, in the show. internet. Yes, yes, I'll show you. I got you, I got you. 